Hey there, Golf Clashers. Um, I just got a comment from Ryan, and uh, he wants to see some Tour 4 hole videos, which I can probably do for you here. Although, a little low on coins, as they say. Spending money for you, Ryan. But that's okay. So here we go. I'm going to uh, try out a tour four hole. The Six Star Hotel. Now this, for some reason, is a very tricky, and I'm, I'm seeing exactly why people are asking about this um, tour four it's uh it's tricky it's hard the wind seems to change it it goes from uh the lower three which there's no wind to the higher three four five and six where the wind just gets crazy this one's not too bad today but um this one here it's yeah you got many ways to go but again my suggestion take your time stay on the fairway because that's the only way you're going to get to the uh, finishing goal here um, your best bet is um, staying to the right side in this one um, you can go to the left it does uh, shorten the course a wee bit but you can get in trouble over there so maybe Gary will go to the left for me here after this shot. Um, obviously you've got your sand traps and uh, that large sand trap on the left there if you do take the left route. Um, but like I always say, stick to the fairways, let them screw up is always your best bet. Well that's uh, pushing it, isn't it? nice shot but I wouldn't suggest trying that one because if you put that a foot further onto the rough then you're way behind me so yeah you can go to the left here if you want um, but it shortens the hole it shortens the hole a little bit but it's not gonna make much of a difference and the sand traps over there are a lot bigger um, so I'm just gonna oops take my time here like I say and just keep laying it out onto the green your fairway and take her down to um, hopefully a draw because you Ryan wanted to see a little critiquing on the shootout hole um, I don't really, really want to lose for the fun of it just to or not win for the fun of it um, if I don't happen to get to the shootout hole on this one I will do it again and put out another video but um, yeah he seems to have the same path of this one it's it's very this one being the par 5 it's one of the longest par 5's because you can't really you know um, go to power use your power see now he's going to use power and see what happened he did not get it on to the perfect dot which he got lucky there and is still on the fairway but if you miss if he missed it a little bit more he's in that sand trap and it's game over because i'm just gonna play the easy way now here's here's where you can get into trouble um going for it he's probably he's further than I am so he's gonna have a better a better shot at getting over that um, sand river as we can call it but I am just gonna lay up here uh, I probably should check my wind positioning here I'm just gonna lay up just because I don't want to 
have a misfire and end up in the sand because it's um, it affects your I mean I got a better chance of sinking this shot than I do from in the sand right and if he does get it over onto the green well you know good on him but uh, yeah he's gonna be pushing it to get across there but I'm sure he's going to try because he's already done the uh, power to get up there. Yeah, he's going to try, but I'm 100% sure he's not making the green. But I'm, again, either way, see, he missed it. He's not going to make the green. Probably in the sand trap. No, he's in the rough. But either way, I mean, it's it's not like it's a horrible position he's in. It's uh, his needle's going to be going pretty fast. But and then there's me, just taking my time, laying up, and getting a good shot at sinking this. Um, wind's blowing towards me a little bit, so I'm going to play that and the hole. Now if I miss this shot I think it's going to go by the hole quite a bit but just maybe just maybe it might go in. Nope. Look at that. Just sitting on the edge. That's why I've always said too that um, the wind doesn't play too much of a factor when you're short chipping. Um, it does a little bit, but not like when you're driving or hitting your second shot, uh, chipping on from a long distance. Now, Gary here's got uh, a pretty good opportunity to win this hole if he can get this to land in the middle of that bullseye. Because he is going to have some speed on this thing. So it's not the easiest to get that right on the button. And he's getting nervous because he's running out of time. See, he missed it. Oh, look at this. It's still going to go. Oh, he's sitting just like me. Okay, so Ryan, we're going to get the shootout hole for you. So, I mean, I guess in both, uh, both facts of the way we took um, and the way we did it, we still ended up with the same scenario at the end. But I can't state any more about if he had missed any of those shots, he'd be in the rough and I would have been putting for the win here. And he'd have been chipping for the tie. So you can do what you want. But if you want to, you know, win most of the time, you should take the easy path and uh, end up winning it straight out, or most likely you'll end up in the shootout, which isn't such a bad thing. So here we go. We're going to hit, uh, hit up the uh, shootout hole. Oh, fun. The island... Sand Island. Um, here's the, another thing with the shootout holes. You, the person going first is at a total disadvantage because the second person gets to see how the wind plays, how far they are away. If he completely misses it and puts it in the sand trap, all I got to do is basically hit it further than him in the sand trap, closer to the wall. Um, so we'll see where he ends up and uh, go from there but this hole yeah the only way to really play it good is you know like what do I do here do I just knock it over into the sand and I win you know it's it's silly uh, the way it kind of goes but I am going to Play it properly though. 
and that wind is going to play a factor. So we'll see what we can do here. Going straight across like that really pushes your ball. I mean, it's it's still only a you know what three six, but I'm gonna play a little bit into the wind there. And I didn't do any better, but believe it or not, I'm gonna win this because I think mine went further onto the. No, he beat me by a tiny bit. See now me trying to play that hole that was a silly idea I should have just shot it um, into the sand trap a little bit further than him but I didn't because I'm trying to show a point and I missed it but that's okay so anyway Ryan there's your uh, tour hole or uh, four hole um, I, uh, I'll try and make another video on it uh, there's two other holes that um, play in this tour four so I'll see if I can find those for you anyway well appreciate all the uh, comments and um, please like the video um, and uh, subscribe to the channel if you like what I'm doing and I will definitely get out some more videos for you soon uh, have a great day thanks